In this video, I'm going to demonstrate the iodine clock reaction. First, I put 20 milliliters of water into two separate beakers, and then I added a small amount of sodium iodate to one of them. To the other, I added a small amount of sodium sulfate, citric acid, and a few drops of saturated starch solution. I guess my script wasn't long enough to fill the whole video. So I'm just adding this in so it's not silent. Both solutions were stirred properly and mixed together. It's a bit of simple dark magic. Now, what if I don't want it to be black anymore? Well, to turn it clear again, I added a bit of sodium thiol sulfate and gave it a long, long stir. So I guess this is a good time to mention that I finished my lab. I have a fume hood, microscope, centrifuge, everything. The whole works, and some good videos are coming soon. It keeps turning back to clear because the sodium thiol sulfate was taking long as f to dissolve. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video, and please subscribe.